Hey guys, this is Mike the Detroit Borg, and I know you guys are going to think I'm crazy, but I'm not a gamer, and this is my first Sony PS3. And I realize this is old news, and nobody really cares about an unboxing of a PS3. At least I didn't think anybody cared, but as soon as I mentioned it on Twitter, everybody asked, am I doing an unboxing of the Sony PS3? And I thought, what the heck, let's go ahead and do it. I have to unbox it anyway, so why not do it on camera? So again, this is just a Sony PS3. PS3 Slim, current generation, uh, it has the 320 gig internal hard drive and one controller. So, not much there. So let's go ahead and unbox it and take a look. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and crack into this. So we got our controller here. We have our AV analog cables, which I will not be using. I'll be using HDMI. So we have a USB cable. This looks like a mini USB to standard USB. We have our power connector. So this is our power cable. We have our literature here. And of course we have the Sony PS3. And that is all. So let's take a look at the Sony PS3 console itself. Of course, it's wrapped in lots of styrofoam. And there it is. Now, taking a quick look around the console itself, you can see it's made out of this black matte plastic. Pretty simple and basic. Has that nice curvaceous design to it. It's quite heavy as I hold it in midair for this demo. Uh, but we have our slot loading drive here. And if you look closely, you can see it has a sort of filter around it, so it keeps the dust out. But we have our eject button there and our power on and off button there. Both of them are physical. You can hear them clicking. On the front, we also have our Sony branding. We also have our USB connectors along with a hard disk status indicator. And we have our labeling here, which just tells us what it's capable of. So this is a Blu-ray drive, DVD, compact disc, has Dolby True HD and Dolby Pro or Dolby Digital Pro Logic processing, DTS HD, Bluetooth. This is a Bluetooth device, so it connects to remotes and uh, the controllers through Bluetooth, and of course has HDMI for connecting to a high def TV. Now on the side we have a whole lot of nothing except for that iconic Sony PS3 curvaceous design. On the back we have our connectors and our serial which I'll cover up. So we have our power connector, our proprietary AV connector, we have our digital optical output, HDMI which is how I'll connect this. We also have our LAN port. Uh, of course this is also wireless so you can connect through wireless. This is not a wireless end device as far as I understand it. So you can't connect to a wireless end network or you can connect to a wireless end network you just can't take advantage of it. And of of course we have our breathing ports here for ventilation. And of course on the bottom we have our Sony PS3 logo along with these feet for gripping onto surfaces. We have some more ventilation on the side. And we have our model number here. So we have CECH 301B. Now taking a quick look at that proprietary cable connector, you can see right there. So if you want to connect your analog cables to your TV, you have to use one of these. I wouldn't recommend it, uh, so I'm going to go with HDMI. Quickly looking at our literature here, we have the Sony PlayStation safety and support document in a variety of languages, all on subject we don't really care about, so I'll set that aside. A guide to video game ratings, of course we know what those are, so again, set that aside. And we have our quick start guide in a variety of languages here. The one I'm interested in is English, of course. So included items, let's just list everything included in the box, and how to install the system, how to set it up, and how to connect it to the internet. So it's pretty basic. So let's go ahead, take a look at our remote controller here. Or our game controller, I keep calling it a remote controller. Now this pairs thanks to this USB connector, so you just need to connect this to the Sony PS3 for the first time, it will pair it. This will also allow you to charge the internal battery, and then it stays wireless. So this is pretty familiar, I guess, to any PS3 user. I've never used a PS3, so this is all new to me, but I'm pretty familiar with any game controller. So we have our shoulder buttons up here. We have our D-pad here. We have our left and right joysticks. Select Start, our PS button. We also have our uh, other buttons here, our X, Square, Triangle, and Circle circle button and that's it all right guys I hope you enjoyed this quick unboxing of the Sony PS3 I probably will only make this available to Twitter Facebook and Google Plus followers I probably will not make this live on YouTube at least initially but what I could use from you guys is some game recommendations this is my first Sony PS3 and I actually have no game so let me know in the comments below I look forward to hearing from you guys and I'll see you again in the next video